Hello, good morning, guys. Welcome to BIMModeler.com. In this tutorial, we are seeing a series of options which is available in the rivet on the property side in this left panel. So we have discussed about the work plane based options and we are looking at the always vertical options. In the help also it's mentioned that for, about the trees. You can see it here, trees always vertical uh, like that. So the electrical panel or the heater, it should be always vertical. It should not uh, be placed on any surface, slanted surface. So in this example, it is a heater. We have placed this heater in the project and I have a section view. If you're trying to rotate any of the family and if it creates some error related to this, it could be one reason that it is mentioned as always vertical. It could be some other reason as well, but it could be one of the reason that it is mentioned as always vertical. So even though if you see that it's not a face based family, even though if it is a face based family that you have created, like last last series I mentioned, work plane based it means as uh, uh, work plane based means a face based family that we are converting into. So I am overriding the existing version with a parameter. I am going to the 3D, I am going to create the object, the equipment. If you see that it's offset from phase, it's zero. Let me make this. If you see that it's if you see it's aligning with the face but it's standing it's not placed on the face of it if i control z and multiple times and component and it, it's a reference level based so it is asking for us to place it on the level but even though if i change this as always vertical turned off and work plane based now it will rotate automatically in the 3D and it will be easy for us to place on the face, not 800 as 0. You can place it on the face, but as I said, this option, even though we are placing some of the equipment on the face or plane based, so the equipment should be as always vertical. We have to tick this option so that by mistake or if it is required, we will place supporting objects. It could be a support at the base or it could be support at the back of the wall or back of our equipment to support it on the wall. So we have to create those objects. It's a reminder that we should not place it on the face directly if it is sloped or slanted. So make sure, make sure of using this option always vertical in a family that requires uh, compulsory always maintains the po posture in, your, in, in the project in the actual environment. So this is a helpful tool when you are using it properly. So do let me know if you have any such questions related to the properties or any specific options that you needed in the Revit family or Revit in the comment section. I can reply in the next tutorials if possible as quick as possible. Do share it with your learning friends and do subscribe and click a like and hype button. So it will be helpful for us to reach out to the other people. So we are trying to achieve one lakh subscriber and uh, within within a short period of time, this will be uh, more much more helpful to us. Thank you so much. See you on the next tutorial. Happy learning.